This VR is for Dwight at Pipe Smoking Knife Maker. Smoking my Moonshine Cannonball Short Fuse with uh, some Sun Bear Tupelo in it. Dwight on the uh, first tobacco that uh, I smoked that I really liked all the way through was probably HH Acadian uh, Perique. It, uh, man, that stuff's good. It's smooth all the way through. You don't get no sour notes or nothing like that. No dawdle where it changes the flavor. Uh, what I smoked has got some age to it. <clears throat> the, uh, that stuff, it really is stout, though. If you don't watch out, it uh, sneak up and get you at the end. Uh, I didn't know it was as stout as it was when I first started smoking it. Started out smoking aromatics, uh, the uh, Cult Blood Red Moon, stuff like that, and, and uh, Autumn Eve. And uh, I'm like you, at the end, it, midways through to the end, it starts getting kind of nasty tasting. But I tell you a little secret that I found out. If you'll stop about halfway through on those aromatics and stuff like that, it's kind of goopy and uh, pull your pipe apart, run your pipe cleaner through it and clean all that moisture out. It really changed the flavor of it. It straightens it back up and it's like it was at the beginning. Uh, that's a little thing I found out. That's about with like this uh, Tupelo Sun Bear here. About halfway through, I had to stop and clean it out. It's getting old, sour, nasty, and it don't matter how clean your pipe is, it just moisture builds up from that aromatic stuff and gives it a bad flavor. Clean all that out, dry it all out, and it's a good dry smoke the rest of the way through and really cleans the flavor back up to the original. I hope this. Uh, <clears throat> is a good little VR for you and that's a good looking knife that you've made and I've looked at your other knives on Instagram and you sure do make some good looking custom knives. Well, we'll get, catch you all later and uh, y'all have a good day.